Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for our weekly Oracle and Tarot card reading. And this will be covering the week of August 7th through the 13th. And all week long, we're going to be using the Magical Mermaids and Dolphins by Doreen Virtue, which I felt was very appropriate, being that it is still summertime. And let's get started. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all angels, light beings, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers for the highest good of all. Take a card from the top. We have weight. Take a card from the center. We have explore your options. And take a card from the bottom for the end of the week. We have oh, treasure chest, very magical card. I think this is one of my favorite cards from the whole deck. They're all very beautiful. And it says, wait, don't rush into action right now. Bide your time for better results. Yes, haste makes waste. Now, I am not the most patient person in the world. <laughs> I want things and I would like them to be done now. <laughs> but this is telling me whatever you are going for, you need to allow things to unfold on its own. Don't jump to any rash decisions this week. The beginning of the week, it's telling you to wait. And what I get from spirit is, is maybe something else needs to fall into place. And just giving a little breathing room to whatever it is that you're going to do or make a decision on is going to allow you to get better results. So don't rush things. Don't hurry. As we know, everything is in divine timing and divine order. And this is telling you to wait just a little while longer. Maybe you need some more facts on something. And maybe some information will come through to you where it will help you benefit in whatever decision you're going to make or whatever next step you're going to take. So wait, don't make any decisions early in the week. And then we have explore your options. And we have this beautiful mermaid down here with the sea turtle. And it's a baby mermaid. It's so beautiful. And it's saying it's time to look at other possibilities. It's a good time to make changes. So yeah, we're being told to wait, okay? Because we do need to decide something. We do need to make a change of some type. And this is telling me that, you know, this is a good time to sit back, weigh the pros and cons, think of all the possibilities that there are so you're not limiting yourself. Okay. There's so many options, but if we rush into things, we might overlook something that's really important. And then towards the end of the week, the last card is treasure chest. And how magical is that? I love the light emanating. And if you can see the expression on her face, she has this look of amazement. And the energy of this card is, is just magical. As soon as I picked it up and, and you see that yellow light, it's just a, a feeling to it. It says an unforeseen windfall of new abundance comes to you now. So how great is that? We're going to take our time in the beginning of the week. Okay, wait, don't jump to conclusions. Sit it out for a little while, allow things to flow and unravel as, as they may, unfold as they may. Maybe some things will need to unravel before the next phase of your life is about to unfold. And, you know, explore your possibilities. There's so many things out there to experience and, and to enjoy. And this is telling you, you know, there's so many things to consider. And then this is uh, assured luck. I'm telling you, it says abundance. So all of this waiting, all of this planning, all of this maybe research, doing your homework on something is going to bring you the victory that you deserve. Um, this is a card of abundance. I mean, she's opening up a treasure chest and it's kind of linked to the second card where there's so many possibilities and the abundance that she is going to be bringing into herself because she took the time and she didn't rush and she waited and she explored all of her options and she thought things out. What a beautiful card to get. Gorgeous, gorgeous reading. Very gentle energy this week. So don't jump the gun. <laughs> Take your time. Think about things. And by the end of the week, you're going to start seeing things in a positive manner. If you've enjoyed this reading, please subscribe to my channel because I will be back.